Our dear President Barack, whose name in Swahili means blessed. We are blessed to live in a time when a man of your stature and nature can be elected to the highest office in our country. You inspire us to achieve greatness, to reach for the stars, and to never give up hope. We would like to remind you that before you can take care of 303 million of us, please remember to take time to take care of yourself. Remember that you did not create the disaster of our economy. Many who now feel you alone are responsible to fix. Remember you too are a human, a father, a husband, a brother, an uncle, and a friend, not just a president. Remember to lead by example and always keep your spirit alive. Take time to appreciate and relish the joys in life. Your beautiful daughters that can enjoy nightly bedtime stories read by you in the most magnificent house on the planet. Your mother-in-law who always comes to your defense. Your soon-to-be first puppy who will bring more joy to your life than you can imagine. And last but not least, your lovely, beautiful, and inspiring wife who is a role model to all women. Please do not leave the White House after eight years, looking 20 years older. Believe a man of wisdom, accomplishment, and continued hope for our future. Our senior class believes success is not measured by what you accomplish, but by the opposition you have encountered and the courage with which you have maintained the struggle against the overwhelming odds. Thank you for helping us find meaning in something greater than ourselves. And remember. 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 A very wise man said that people will not judge us for what we destroy, but for what we can build. 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 For what we can build.